Alright, so what's going on, all my and Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Uh, welcome back to a brand new command block video on the channel. We are back again with the command series. Yep, and today I'm going to be showing you how to use the slash effect command. So, this slash effect command is very, very simple. It's a very, very cool command and it's very easy to do. If you're wondering why I'm in my inventory, you don't actually need your inventory. I'm just getting a few buckets of milk. Um, just so I can take away the effects once I have done them. So let's do this here like this and oh no, what am I doing? Let's do this like this and uh, yeah, let's get a few buckets of milk. So I probably won't need this many. It's just here just in case and uh, yeah, uh, no, yeah. So <clears throat> the slash effects command. It's a very easy command to do, very fun to do, and um, you can either have a great time with your mates. Or you can very easily troll them. So I'm going to show you how to do it in today's video. And then you can go and try it out for yourself. And let me know what you think. So the slash command. Um, slash effect command is a very simple command. It's just a chat command once again. You can write in command blocks. just a lot easier to write in the chat. So all you got to do is write slash effect. Which you can see. Add or remove status effects. You can either choose a player. Yourself. A random player. The closest player. All entities are all players. I'm just going to do at all since I'm the only person in the game. Then you can choose what you want, so let's do, let's do speed, I want to add speed to myself. Then you choose the length of time you want it, so if you want it to be the max amount of time you can do, you just do six nines. So I want it to have, um, I want it to be the longest time I can do, so I've just chose six nines here. And then you choose the power, how powerful you want the effect to be. So, I want it to be the most powerful it can be, which is 255, five, and you're going to see why I want that in a second. I do 255. Five. And then you can either have it false, which shows the particles, or you can have it as true, which hides the particles. So because I don't want the particles to be showing, because I don't want anyone else to have effects, I do true. And you can see here on the side that I have speed, not even the numbers is max for that. And then when I run, I am very, very fast. This is great for making speed running maps as well, um, this effect. And it's just cool to control your friends. There's another one I'm going to show you how to do. So if I do... If I do, oh, can I just stop? There we go. Alright, if I change this to false, however, let me just show you what happens when I change it to false. I do false. And it shows the particles. But then when I change it back to true, it will hide the particles and reset the time. So, let me drink a bucket of milk here. <clears throat> oh, slapped. And let's do, oh, I didn't need multiple buckets. I've got refills. And then let's do slash effect at S. Uh, let's say jump on the score boost. Yeah, jump underscore boost. And I don't want it for the max because it just shoots you into the clouds and you can never come down. Let's make it about 8. Right. Now look, I can jump really, really high depending on the power you put on it. If you do 255, I'm not going to show it now. You can try it out for yourself or you can do it to your one of your mates. Um, yeah, um, if, you have, if you make sure they have jump boost always in the game, if you change it to this one... Uh, they won't even notice, they'll see in the top right, but if you change the particles to true, they won't even notice they have the new one, they'll think it's just glitched. But uh, yeah, so I'll let you try that one on your own, but it's really cool because you can jump like high. Uh, you can also do saturation, um, I'd recommend doing 255 for this. This means that when their hunger goes down, um, it will go back up, it will go down like half a, half a uh, hunger bar, and then they'll see that, but then it will go back up as they carry on running because they have saturation, so it won't actually um, stay like that. Uh, this is a very easy command to do again. It's just a slash effect. I used it in my um, how to make blocked item uh, dropped items give effects. Uh, that's a really cool command. So I'd definitely go check out that video as well. Um, I've got a few more videos coming out soon as well. So definitely stay tuned for those. But that's about it for this video. Um, don't forget to like if you haven't already. Um, it's very appreciated. It lets me know that you are enjoying this kind of type of content and uh, and it inspires me to do more. If you're new around here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. I upload at 5.45 p.m. GMT whenever I do upload, but I do it in time zones. So I don't want you to my upload, so definitely hit the notification bell so you don't miss one. Comment down below what you thought of the video, what you want to see next. Any other command ideas that you have got for me, um, please let me know. I will try my best to make them. And if you see them on the channel, it means I was successful. And if you don't, it means I was either unsuccessful. I just haven't had enough time to do it yet. Uh, but yeah, check out the description uh, for more stuff. I don't really want to promote because apparently it takes away your YouTube kind of promotion thing. But yeah, that's about it. Have a great day for everyone watching this. Thank you. Have a good one. Have a great day for everyone watching this, like I just said. Yeah, okay. I'm, I've messed up my intro. Goodbye. <laughs>